With Guyana being the United Kingdom's largest trading partner in the Caribbean, British High Commissioner to Guyana, Jane Miller, said the UK is exploring the possibility of establishing the British Chamber of Commerce here. The High Commissioner made the announcement during the Queen's Platinum Jubilee birthday celebration held at the British High Commissioner's residence at Bellier Gardens in Georgetown. According to the UK diplomat, trade between the two countries increased sixfold in the last 10 years, reflecting strengthening economic partnership. Total trade in goods and services in the, between the UK and Guyana last year was £560 million. This represents 21.6% of all trade between the UK and the Caribbean, making Guyana the UK's largest trade partner with the Caribbean. Earlier this year, a British trade mission visited Guyana, where a memorandum of understanding was inked between the Georgetown Chamber of Commerce and the Caribbean Council. The High Commissioner said to foster more opportunities, there will be more trade missions this year. Meanwhile, as a result of President Dr. Irfan Ali's visit to the UK in April this year, a deeper formal framework for future commercial engagements is being developed. During the visit, President Ali met with UK's Prime Minister Boris Johnson, paving the way for the establishment of a government-to-government -government partnership. In my most recent meeting with Prime Minister Boris, we are not talking about MOUs anymore. We have advance the relationship between Guyana and the UK to be what we call government-to-government -government cooperation and defining and developing a government-to-government -government partnership. President Ali noted that there is a great platform for investment opportunities for Guyana from the UK, but the government and private sector in Guyana must be ready. I was at a very important meeting with huge financial institutions in the UK. And what I heard at that meeting was mind-blowing. That is assessing the risk of Guyana, assessing all that has to be done. There is an envelope of resources through the UK that is there for government and private sector that is in the hundreds of millions of pounds. Guyana is also working with the UK to dismantle trade barriers for easier access to the European market and strengthened trade relations. Reporting for the newsroom, I am Isinello Pato.